Ah, uh, yes, the gaming gods bless. Welcome back. Good to see everybody here. We are ready to go with some Kebab Chef Restaurant Simulator. Apparently, this game is a co-op restaurant simulator that just dropped today on Steam. Uh, yeah, seems pretty cool. I don't have uh, someone else to play with at the moment, but if this is good enough, I think I want to play some multiplayer, and that sound means it just downloaded. So, welcome aboard. Good to see you all here. I'd been seeing a few other people playing this, including the devs, and it looked cool. It's got a really good art style to it. It reminds me a bit of, like, the tenants and stuff like that. So if you're a big fan of The Sims or any sort of simulator game, this one could be for you with a lot of shenanigans to be had. So welcome back, Raptoria. Good to see you here. Oh, oh. Watch the... Uh, I think we're going to watch the video for this one. But anyway, yeah, welcome aboard. One's in the chat. Chat, where yet? Good to see everybody with us. Oh, it has seven reviews now. Uh, it just had one when I downloaded it. Uh, 14 bucks, by the way. Again, remember, co-op, if you... Uh, enjoy Ooh, oh you can play with more than two people good oh you can have like four people running the restaurant this would be perfect for me dirty red and lumberjack and stuff this would be a lot of fun uh i've been on a kick this week of playing games that are similar to like uh power wash simulator and uh like gas station simulator we played uh, a beer simulator a delivery simulator uh, we played uh, restaurant simulator games in the past and owning your own uh, convenience stores and stuff, but this should be a good time. So let's check it out and see how it all goes. Uh, Kebab Chef co-op cooking and restaurant management game that could be played up to four players. Oh, and you get to design it and stuff too. This is awesome. So if you like uh, cook, serve, or rather, what is it called? Overcooked? Yeah. Then this is the perfect one for you. Oh, this is going to be a lot of fun. Oh, man. I can already tell. All right, let's watch. Oh, this is legit. Oh, whoa. Oh, this is legit. Dude, whoa, what's going on here? Love the love the building, love the customization. Alright, this looks like a hell of a lot of fun. I love the art style by the way, all the, the look of everything. I love that. It reminds me of like a switch game or something, but this this actually looks like a ton of fun. You get to own and operate a restaurant with friends, and you get to clean up trash and take care of all the guests, and that's good. And all the cooking, of, of course, of course. Oh, this is going to be great. i got to play this with, like, She Fox and Bradford and Jerry. Everybody, this would be perfect for all the friends. The fringe, the fringe group. Okay, let's jump in. Let's go. You've been excited about this one since spring, so hyped you're playing it today. Yeah, there's a couple of uh, cooking simulators I've been wanting to play, too. Well, conveniently, this one just dropped today, so... Alright, let's bring it up. Let's go. Let's make our character. Alright, let's see. Pants? Yeah, we should probably wear pants. Nope, that's not pants. That's literally skin color. <laughs> um, did the developers know what pants mean? But... I don't think they know what pants mean. All right, whatever. We'll go with this guy. Wait. All right, let me let me adjust that a little bit. Hold on. Thick, indeed. Okay, let's get back to it then. So, clothes. I want to see how I'm going to look with clothes on, because that's what you're going to be wearing. Uh, maybe we'll go for that? Well, that looks nice. Oh wait, it's got a logo on the back. Oh, it's a motorcycle. 
I think I'm gonna go with this one. Oh, I gotta I gotta play this with like lumberjack and do I'm already wanting to play this in multiplayer. This is great. Okay, let's do pants, okay, shoes. What is, why are the options like ridiculous work boots, normal shoes, and then like those look like jalapenos. Let's just go with that. I can't believe I'm not wearing socks. We can wear a watch, I guess. Oh, we can change the color of our shoes. Let's go. That's too matchy-matchy. Oh, there we go. Hold on. Let's go with some... Let's go with these. I just have, like, red? Oh, there we go. Okay, let's go with that. Okay. So much for being, like, a chef-chef, but okay. Uh, hair? We're gonna have to have, like, a burger place where everything's made out of industrial materials and then charge, like, $14 for a burger. Have I played Bronze Beards Tavern? Co-op as well with one to eight players. No, I have not. Can someone send me a DM on uh, Bronze Beards Tavern? I would love to do a multiplayer uh, tavern simulator as well. We have played Traveler's Rest before, but that's only two. All right, let's go with hair. Mm. Okay, well, we're limited in our options. We'll go... That seems fine. Now what about, oh my god, a sombrero? What the hell? They give you a lot of options. <laughs> all right, all right, we'll go with the sunglasses. Wow, they give you a lot of options. Almost too many options. Okay, we'll go with that. What about facial hair? Uh, that seems fine. Yeah, that's good. Does that match? Uh, oh, there we go. That matches. Oh, this game does beards pretty okay. There's a weird disconnect there, but okay. Whatever. Cover that up with the sunglasses. Alright, this is fine for me. I think we're good. Alright, let's go. Oh, there's different maps, too. Or at least it says neighborhood map. There's a sandbox mode. Is there a story mode coming? Oh, maybe there's going to be more. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Stop calling me. Father. Uh, hey kid, are you still asleep? I told you to come down here in the morning. Uh, e to sk I don't want to skip. How do I go to the next dialogue? Uh, quit being lazy and come meet me in front of the old restaurant. Today is an important day for you. What, Dad's just randomly in giving us a restaurant without any prior notice? Where the hell are we? Poland? <laughs> Look at that fridge. It's so small. And we're, we have vines growing inside of our house. Where the hell are we staying? Well, that's actually a really nice house. Giraffe. Uh, I should blow these candles out before we leave. That could be a fire hazard. Okay, let's leave. Ooh. Beer pub. Oh, I want to go in there. 
<gasps> I can. Okay, we can go out for drinks later. Uh, where's the restaurant? Here? No, it's a butcher shop. That's probably where we're going to buy meats and stuff. Oh, here. Yeah, this is the old restaurant? What happened? Mm. Oh, there you are, son. You must be wondering why I called you here. Mm. Time for you to stand on your own two feet. Here to guide you uh, to our family heritage with the restaurant and take your first steps towards becoming the best chef in the city. Mm. I see you're impatient. New generation. Ah, uh -uh, this new generation. All right, then. Take this key and let's get inside. Enter the restaurant. Okay. What happened mm. in here? Mm. Oh, my dear. This is a total mess. Wait, Dad, your neck okay? Jeez. Okay. <clears throat> Looks worse than I remember. It's good to be back. Should you get cleaning this mess first? I mean, you should. You know, I would really like to help, but I'm an old man now. All right, I got it. Every game, like legally, whenever you're playing one of these like simulators, you there always is an old, abandoned, rundown, like no good restaurant or like bar or gas station or something, and it always has to be renovated every time. Like, Dad could have been like, oh, dude, this was, dude, this is the best restaurant in town. We make millions of dollars a day. People fly from all over the world to this restaurant. They they leave $10 million tips. Oh, but you're going to need to clean it up, and it's decrepit and old. Like, it has, th this is how it always goes, whether you're playing, like, uh, what is it, uh, Arcade Paradise. Well, that's another one I want to play. Beer Factory. This is what you got to do. You always got to clean the floor. This is, like, legally required. Okay, clean the dirt on the walls and floors. Is there a broom? Yeah, always. Like, it's a legal requirement. Hey, <laughs> you're at work cooking? I'm at work cooking, too. Well, we don't even have a bathroom? This, this could be a freezer, for all I know. Um... I guess maybe I just look at it. Oh, okay. I was like literally looking for a broom or a mop, but nope. Just a good old bubbly sponge. Mm. Nice job. It is indeed a good beginning after all. It's always important to keep your workplace clean. Now let's fix these tainted walls and floors. What was that online store you were mentioning? Oh, of course, and we always have a tablet, too. Okay, um... Warehouse menu, recipes, perks, staff help, gourmet, and bank. Maybe warehouse? Surfaces? Oh, we're gonna go with brick, okay. It's free, so... Oh god, sorry. <laughs> And floors. Mm. Nice and smooth. Better than ever before. Now let's get rid of this broken furniture. I'm gonna go into edit mode. There we go. Oh, cool. We start with like a little kebab maker right there. Nice. Uh, something else is broken. Where? It's not this, is it? I'd like to put that over here, maybe? Okay, sell all the objects while in edit mode. It's gonna be some on the wall. Is it this? No, that's fine. Oh, this. Oh. That's gotta go. 
Uh, it keeps getting better, don't you think? Now, we have uh, the space we can fill with brand new furniture. Open the store thing again, would you? Uh, buy two tables. Okay. Oh, we could change the color. Let's go for this color. That looks nice. Let's put it by the windows. Cool. Mm. Uh, you also need a sink and a counter. It's important to have some ground to work. We already have a sink. A, a big one, too. Damn. Uh, let's do... Yeah, the interior is quite... Yeah, it's quite impressive. It actually looks really nice. I wonder if we can modify the lights? We can. Cool. So we can even change the lighting. Okay, let's go to counter section. Oh, we can change the sign. We'll do that later. I want it to match this one. Oh, it does. Navigate to stations. Buy a knife rack. 500 bucks? Damn. I feel like we should put a... I want to put a counter back here along this wall. Like, I don't, I don't want to do everything up in front of the customer. But maybe that's a marketing thing. Like, they'll walk in and they'll be like, ooh... Like, we get to watch them make the kebab live. Uh, make your preparations and open up when ready. All right, kid, it's almost done. Now we just need some kitchen tools to get you started. I need you to go and pick up some packages from the market. The owner of the place prepared it for me. I know him. I've known him for decades. You'll be visiting his place very often. All right, let's go. So, does he mean the butcher shop or the grocery store? Korkmas. Is that, is that Polish? This town is pretty. Basoglu? Oh, this is the guy. Is it? Is this the guy? Oh, that is the guy. Hey, sir. Oh, you must be the new chef of the neighborhood. Your dad was a great cook. I'm really happy the place is back up. Uh, here's the good your father's want, your father wanted me to prepare. You can always visit my place if you need something. Thanks, bro. Mixing bowl, skewer, kindling bag, and a coal bag. Thank you very much, sir. Hey, Bob. Hmm. Nice job, kid. Now get everything out of the box and let's get cooking. What's in the box? Well, that'd be our mixing bowl. Another mixing bowl. A skewer. Another skewer. Kindling bag. And a coal bag. Dude, this is actually, like, kind of cool. All right, here we have it, a, a decent small restaurant to begin chasing your dreams with. Now, let's get to the delicious part. Remember the recipe book I gave you? It's great that you save them digitally. Open the restaurant tab. Do they mean menu? Restaurant menu, yeah. Grilled beef. Oh, ribeye slice, salt, black pepper, tomato, and parsley. Really? Pin an active order. Mm. Uh, we need ingredients to cook. That means it's time for shopping. There are three local shops you can buy from. Grocery, the book butcher, the market. I know the owner lads for a long time. They've always been fresh ones. 
As in every restaurant, the ingredients necessary for you to cook delicious meals will run out as you use them. By visiting the butcher, gro green grocer, and market, you can obtain the materials you need. Okay. This is really cool, actually. Because, okay, this multiplayer is genius because you could have somebody running out and taking, like, <gasps> Sorry, ma'am. Having somebody... <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> you could have somebody, like, running out and, like, you know, doing inventory and going and picking up stuff and, like, planning out the menu. And then you could have somebody cooking and somebody cleaning. And uh, that's awesome. Hello. Uh, I'll take one of these. Thank you for putting it in a cardboard box, sir. <laughs> Bye. Did I update the sign? Not yet, but they might tell me to do that soon. We're gonna have to figure out a name for this place, chat. This is legit, I love this. Oh, they already told us about that. I, I knew I'd like this. Okay, go to grocery. Wait, I did, oh, I gotta go there now. Okay. That was the butcher I went to. Now the grocer is here. I like the fact that there's like a little parking lot and then a public square. Wow. These cars, though. Four storm. What the hell's TR in, in the European Union? Transylvania? Tomato! Tomato! One, two, three, four, five. Parsley. Hello, binging with Babish. I would like to purchase your finest Babish, please. Thank you, sir. Uh, that's a region of Romania and shouldn't have its own tag. I guess they're a rogue breakaway nation just suddenly. Mm. It's almost time for me to eat. I hope my child can cook me a delici delicious kebab. All right, I'm on it. Um, well, I guess we gotta put the coal in here, right? Oh. Okay, cool. Do I have to turn it on or like? I need to add kindling. Oh, take a ribeye chunk. Okay. I should probably put this down here, shouldn't I? Oh, nice. Dude, we can actually put stuff on shelves and whatnot. This is awesome. Oh, look at that big old ribeye. Okay, I'm going to slice it up. Game of the year. Take a ribeye slice. Add black pepper. Uh, shouldn't I do this somewhere sanitary, like on the cutting board, but like a different one? Do we not have another prep station? God, it's so unsanitary. All right, add black pepper. salt take the coal package take the king kindling package okay wait for the bottom side of the ribeye slice to cook uh, do, uh, do I add it here? Oh, this is legit. Dirty loves to barbecue. This would be the game for him. I think, yeah, we might have to mention to Lumberjack and Dirty that they, they might really like this.
Oh, now I gotta flip it. Okay, so how do I flip? Okay. Oh, so it gets to halfway, then you gotta flip it, and then that'll fill the bar fully. Okay. Uh, take a plate from the plate cabinet. Uh, which one? Any of them? Uh, plate the kebab and the in ingredients. Is that a, really a kebab? Like, that's just a steak, brother. Side ingredients? You mean the tomato and the parsley? Okay, dude, here's a whole tomato. I'm supposed to grill the tomato. Slice of ribeye, add it to the thing. Bake each side. That's grill. Can we steal in this game? Uh, I don't know. I mean, using your Twitch Prime sub is certainly a steal. <laughs> Exclamation point Twitch if you're watching on YouTube. Uh, that's a steal. Grill the tomato and then slice it. All right, let's do that. I can already tell you I'm going to redo a lot of my work area. How's the army enlistment going? Well, we got a lot of people. Mil million troops in this army. One million troops in this army. Okay. All done. So then what, we cut this up? Oh, God. Hot, hot tomato. Hot tomato. Okay. And this is what, one tomato? Oh, that looks nice. That looks nice. And then parsley. Um, I don't think I could choose. Can I choose what I pull out of the box next? Oh, I can. Okay. And then... Bam. Oh, I gotta do two. Two parsley pieces? Dad, is this your recipe? What are you crazy? Oh wait, these are <laughs> I'm supposed to cut these up, I think. Oh, okay, my bad. I was trying to Okay, it's just the pieces, the small Okay, sorry, I didn't realize okay. I didn't okay. Uh, okay. Big, big, big parsley fan. Big parsley fan. <laughs> I didn't know. All right, serving counters are where you uh, finalize your food presentations. Okay. Uh, serve the dish on the serving table. Oh, this isn't like where people check in at. Okay. All right, hey, not bad. Mm -hmm. 1.5. Well, I, ex I expected it to be bad. It'll get better. Oh, he seems to be happy. Oh, looks nice. Dad, you're adding more salt? You told me to do three. By. That's a tight fit, but okay, let's put this counter back here. We definitely got to move this area around a little bit. Do we need to wait till he's done or what? Oh, what'd you think? Huh? Do you like it? Mm. Of course, after every satisfied customer, there will be a dish to clean. You'll have to clean plates before uh, using them again. We won't want the customers to get their food on dirty plates, right? Okay. I can figure this out. Money! 120 bucks? Damn. See, I told you, Chad. I know how to cook a... Whatever that was. And we actually have to... Oh, you're going to have to have somebody doing dishes, too? This is going to be really good in multiplayer. And then we probably have to return the plates, yeah. 
And that music was getting annoying. What is this, a fridge? Concerning that, I could see the back of the thing through here. I think you pretty much got the basics. You can uh, make a new beginning from here and go bigger as you move forward. Now flip that sign and let people know that you're ready to serve. Alright, let's do it. Mm. There you go. Uh, there you go. Don't forget to expand your menu. Remember, if you can find yourself struggling uh, to deal with customers, you can always hire some employees to help you out. Good luck. Thanks, Dad. Bye. Sir, I don't know if that's on our menu. I don't know what that is. Oh, wait. Yeah, we got one here. Wait, should I flip it the other way? Wait, this is like a self-serve counter? Hmm. Why does it keep snapping that way? Here. Like, it should be like this. Like, th th wait, we're, it's more like a buffet. Like, if they're just going to come on in and grab a plate of already pre-made food, this, th that's just basically the, a, a buffet. Whatever. Anyway, let's do this again. I want to work on my work. Uh, cl uh, hey, 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 what the hell? Jeez. I like how I don't have to wash my hands. <laughs> now let's make better beef. All right, I guess we'll redo our work area tomorrow when there's no customers. All right, let's do three black pepper. Three salt. Let's rip and dip. I love this chat. We're going to be able to get all organized. Beautiful. Although I wish we could put our ingredients somewhere else. Like, I'm not gonna put the tomatoes in the refrigerator. Okay. And I, I, I guess we'll unlock more recipes in time. What was that noise? Oh, the fire went out. That's bad. Okay, we need plates. Two pieces of parsley. I think that's it, right? Mm-hmm. Looks good. Is this game on console? That's a good question. I do not know. Can I buy another one of these? I want to buy another display thing. There it is. Starter, plate shelf. I guess we'll do this one. Kind of, it, it locks it to these weird angles. Like, I, I want to change how I display it, but it. It won't let me, like, do what I want to do. Oh, well.
won't let me... Wait, I can't put down different dishes? Why do I have to go to... Can't they just leave money and leave? that way but okay well we better buy some more tables be a problem here is that the uh, food will get cold. This is going to be amazing if we play this multiplayer. This is cool to learn though. Uh, hello. Man, what are you doing? Coming behind the counter to make it yourself? Get out. Get out of here. Mm. 150 bucks a plate. Oh, this is some foreign currency, you know? It's that weird CHF currency. Oh, she seems happy. All right, good. Thank you, ma'am. Dude, imagine when this place is super busy in multiplayer. You're going to have people to... It, it's amazing. Kind of weird, though, that self-serve. Like, we just put the food in, like, a buffet, and then it just magically works. Oh, putting the plate thing next to the kitchen sink was a good idea. That was a good move. That's pr pro move. Pro gamer move. Oh, well, I guess I'm going to sell this thing. Because it didn't work the way I thought it would. Huh. Hello, sir. Was he licking the plate clean? When do I close? Do I have to close? Hmm. We have mini kebab in Switzerland. Oh, good. That's good. Jerry, thank you very much for the gifted membership for chat. Welcome aboard. Oh, boy. We're out of food. Okay, I think we're going to have to close mm. and go purchase a bunch of ingredients now that we know how the basics work. I think we could at least get away with selling that basic kebab for a while. We just need more meat. Which we could probably put a lot in the fridge. Huh. Day is over. Clean up and close the restaurant to finish the day. Okay, so we close at like 2130? Actually, the time is frozen at 2144. What a weird time to freeze. Can't I set my own hours? What is this? Man, that fire goes for a long time. I guess we can get a better uh, little uh, grill, too. Now, I wonder, are the other businesses closed as well? No, these dudes are open 24-7. Well, what, that's what I'm saying. Let's stay open, baby. Business 24-7. I'll buy eight of these bad boys. All right, cool. We'll get started with the basics.
Now, can I just put this box in here? Should be able to. Oh, yeah, look. It's got the little refrigerator logo right there. Okay. All right. All right, I want to redo stuff. We've got drawers. That's cool. So we should definitely put this cutting board next to the grill. Hey, Don. Thank you very much for the six months as a Raptor Plus. Welcome aboard. Good to see you in the chat. I think I want to do it this way. Have the knives to the right. I don't know what the mixing bowls were for. Something else. We'll use that later. I think I'm going to keep these in here. All right. Um, it feels weird to put these tomatoes anywhere, even in the fridge. It's like, okay. I guess. I'm not going to put it on this dirty shelf with the radio. Can we sell the radio? Or we can store it. Press tab and go to inventory on warehouse. Oh, okay. Okay, cool. Do I have to clean this? No. That would be an easier way. Can't we just take all the parsley and put it in like a, a little box or something? Boom, that's the, that's the meat, meat prep command center right here. Boom. Yeah, they were licking the plates clean. It must have been damn good. Must have been finger licking good for sure. Okay, so. Yeah, I don't like how that works. I don't like how the customer comes up to get their food. Like, we can't have somebody go to them and ask them what they want and then prepare it. A little weird. Also, time is frozen. So that's good. So we have time at night to be able to customize everything. Do I have to take out the trash? No. Nope. We'll do the sign later. I wonder if we can get a neon sign. That'd be cool. What's some of this stuff? Hanging skewer rack. Cutting station. And some other things are locked. Oh, outdoors. Oh, we can get a different door, but we got to get a higher level. No, we better toy with that in the daytime. We can get stance. What is, what is that symbol? What are the What are these symbols? Oh, it looks like there's a mixing. Uh, yep, we're going to do dessert eventually and have croissants. I wonder if these actually give us uh, like different prestige if we use different colors and stuff. Yeah, let's turn the uh, let's turn the stand. Although it keeps snapping back the other way, so we want to go this way, right? So the customer can walk up and take their food. And then if we try to snap it next to the the table, it just goes the other way. I don't I don't like that. Is there a way to rotate it? Oh, we can right-click. Okay, there. Oh, there we go. Oh, that's all I had to do. Goober me. I'm a goober. <laughs> no air fryer. I haven't seen one. Okay, anything else for shelving? Uh, yes, but also no. We got better lights. And eh, that's all going to be for later. Let's put some plants in, though. Make this place look nice. Um, 
We definitely need to do some decor. Although, does it really pay off at all? What are these? Oh, is that air conditioning unit? Oh, wow. Wicker basket. Okay. Wait, there was other stations. Ooh, a stove. Oh, the kitchen's going to get so much bigger because we're going to have like stove tops and stuff going. Mini freezers, small freezers. Okay. Okay. All right. Uh, right. Let's, let's go call it a day and we'll, we'll think about design and stuff tomorrow. All right. That's, that's actually pretty legit though, that there's a lot of stuff to decorate with. Now we can do the walls and stuff. Hey, we're level two. And we made a thousand bucks and had three thousand dollars in expenses. <laughs> Alright, well to be fair that we did have to buy a bunch of stuff. Dad made us made us buy from his friends. I think he's working with the mob. We'll need the stove for tomato soup, maybe. Mm. What the hell's this? Oh look what we have here. The apple doesn't fall far from the tree, mm. does it? I've seen this place. Ma'am? I've seen this place rise and fall before you. Sir? You must be his kid. Let's hope you're not another disappointment. Tee hee. Mm. I hope you understand the delicate nature of this industry, kid. This is the kid. Ma'am? Ma'am. Okay. Pe this is a culinary jungle. Only the strongest survive. Let's see if your little venture can withstand the heat. Mmm. Get the gourmet authorities appro approval first, and m then maybe I'll be willing to confront you. If I'm in a good mood, tee hee. Mm. Good luck, newbie, if that's possible. Bro, why are you trying to... Oh, you have to have... Oh, my God, this is Iron Chef tier. Oh, that's what this is. We have to kick their asses to unlock new tiers of stuff. That is freaking genius. Why has nobody done an Iron Chef thing like this before? That's outstanding. We gotta kick uh, L. Babish's ass, then Elder Babish's ass, and then Girl Babish's ass. Oh my god. That's genius. Is there more? There's more. There's an arrow to the right, but I can't click on it. Oh. This is gonna be cool. That's going to be so cool. Oh, man. Because then they're going to each have their specialty. There's going to be like, I don't know, spicy food, baking. Oh, yeah. I'm ready to kick ass. Let's do it. Okay, we have to unlock chicken breast. Okay, we can do that, too. We can do that. We can do that. Uh, what, what do we need to buy? Oh. Wait, that's beef. Chicken breast, salt, chili pepper, red pepper, green pepper, potato. Alright, I'm going I'm going shopping. Oh, by the way, I huh. really appreciate at the top how the time is frozen. That's really nice because if you're playing multiplayer, everybody has time to communicate a little bit, and time only goes when you're running the restaurant. So this gives everybody time to like have a meeting and be like, okay, what are we going to do? Okay, you go over and buy the chicken. Okay, you go buy the beef. You know, like all that stuff. Love that. Love that. Yeah, that's a really cool system. Like the Iron Chef system. Like we got we to gotta beat all these rival chefs in order to unlock new stuff. That's cool. Wow, that is a big ass chick. Oh, that's turkey. <laughs> Wait, is that turkey or chicken? Looks like in between. Yeah, I'll buy a chicken. What is that currency? J Swish Wish? What the hell is that? Where's the beef? I'm going to tell Dirty and Lumberjack and Red and Alex and everybody to to get this game and we we need to run a co op restaurant together. It has to happen. We'll put everybody in charge of stuff. What is this building? <gasps> Can we expand and get a bigger restaurant? 
Oh, this is nice. Yep. Wow, look at all the space in here. There's at least one pixel. Wow. Okay. So that's the goal, is to get a bigger restaurant. So you can get a bigger restaurant. And maybe build in other locations. Alright, let's pin this recipe. Okay, so we need... Uh, Got the chicken breast. Let's do the red pepper. And let's do the... What the hell are these other things? <laughs> Alright, potato. Eggplant emote. Uh, we need green peppers as well. It looks like a habanero. Wait. It says we also need chili pepper. Season with salt and chili pepper. Do I need to buy like a shaker? Is that lemon? Wait, where? I, yeah, lemons. There. Okay. Cool. Okay, we need to go to the market. I feel like that doesn't have to be refrigerated. Yeah, none of, none of that should have to be refrigerated. You're right, hot pepper too. Could you imagine? Okay, if Dave the Diver Two ended up looking like that new Cloud Punk game coming out, the uh, Welcome to Navalis, where you get to like own and operate your own ramen shop, I'm going to die. I will, I will die to death, and I, it will be a happy death. Cook pot, oval plates. Oh yeah, we gotta buy some uh, charcoal. Bread crumbs, butter. Why did? Why is it coming a tin of spam? Cheddar cheese. We might be able to make fondue. There might be fondue making in this. Rice. Oh, we can make risotto. Rosemary chili. Oh, we might need to buy that. Yep. The chili pepper. Buy one of those. Red lentils, salt. What the hell is that? Raspberries? Uh, hazelnuts, pistachios, sugar, gelatin powder. Chicken, what now? Chicken. Can chick? Chicken. Chicken broth. Ooh, look at the, ooh, look at the knives. Ooh. Oh, wow. Flowers. Okay, uh, we need to buy something else. What was it? Oh, yeah. Let's buy two bags of charcoal. Two bags of kindling. Yeah, we'll buy four. Thanks, bro. Love small shops like that. Really wish there were more of them. Okay. My shaker. How do I know how many shakes these have left in them? Oh, there. 144, 150, 144. Okay, cool. So we actually have to go buy more salt and pepper, too. That's really cool. I want more cooking games like this, damn it. There was so many that are like single player baking games and whatnot, and then eventually they kind of become boring because there's. You got to do everything yourself, but as a team. With it being multiplayer. Right now, of course, we're playing single, so but I'm using this as a scouting to like be like, oh yeah. We gotta play with the boys. 
Alloy, 33 months. Thank you, dude. The Raptor Hatchling, more months are needed. Yes. Yes, they are. Kidling. Okay, cool. All right, now, uh, before we start opening the restaurant, let's put these on our menu. So we're serving chicken breast and grilled beef. So I do need one, another one of these, don't I? So then... I guess I can put this, these over here. I, I find that to be so weird. We're making like a buffet, I guess. But it just seems so... Tacky. Okay, so we can use this. It just it has to be on the menu. Where do I put this? Also, we don't even have a now wait a minute, hold on. Let me just put this down just to okay. uh there's a bathroom here, but we don't have options to put anything in the bathroom at all? So what is this? Just a storeroom then? I guess if no one's going to use the bathroom, we could just turn it into a... Yeah, I, I guess you could just use this as a storeroom, but that looks like it would be a bathroom. Hmm. <laughs> Fondue with cheddar, sir, have some respect. I mean, just because it says cheddar on the bag. I mean, there could there could be. I find that so awkward. Like, hey, welcome to our restaurant. Grab your own stuff and get out. Like, what is this? Uh, make preparations and open when you're ready. Customers 7 to 9. We're going to have 7 to 9 people come in? Okay. Well, before they come in, I guess we should have some food ready to go, right? Let's start with the chicken breast. Oh, we can keep stuff in the boxes. Nice. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Let's start from the top. Slice of potato. Okay. That's a nice looking potato. Uh, add to the plate red pepper, green pepper, potato slices. Raw? Oh, I was at the bottom. <laughs> My bad. We'll just move these over here. Okay, chicken breast. Oh, I love how the that smoke. All right, a chicken breast. We need three salt, three chili pepper. Dirty's gonna love this. We're putting Dirty in charge of this. probably in the chat but you know he's technically banned from YouTube forever okay bake each side all right You gotta actually wait for it to warm up a little bit. Cool. Okay. Oh, let's get a plate.
Okay, and then real red pepper, green pepper, to, uh, potato. If we, g if you get to a big enough restaurant, you can actually have multiple cook stations going and then multiple people doing that stuff. That's going to be crazy. Okay, is that it? Red pepper, green pepper, potato, yep. Yeah. Wow, chicken was super easy. Two point nine. We're improving. Hey, look, n not bad, not bad. All right, let's do the beef now. Boom. Let me change the recipe I'm looking at. Tomato going. I gotta go buy more of those. Contamination. Alright. Um. Big steak. Big steak. Wait. And we gotta add parsley too. Speaking of restaurants, have you watched The Bear? What is that? What is The Bear? Okay. And we need to add that parsley too. Flies on that? Uh oh. Rotten parsley. Oh no. How do I throw it all out?
That went bad today? What the hell kind of parsley did that guy sell me? I literally picked it up 24 hours ago. Is it ice cubes? I'm gonna go yell at that guy so hardcore. Oh, it's gonna get cold now too. Uh, who sells parsley? This guy? Babish? Damn it. I'll buy two. Huh. Huh. Honestly, how does parsley go bad in like 24 hours? Boom. I think they want more heat, but... Wait, can I change up the recipe myself and like add stuff to it and like make it better? Does it need to be refrigerated? Probably not, but you know what? That probably wouldn't... Oh, wait. There's a refrigeration symbol there. Oh, if it's got a refrigeration symbol, it does. Well, who the hell refrigerates potatoes and green peppers? And parsley? What the hell? Wait, th that appeared now. Whatever. Everything's going in the fridge. New company policy. All right, we're opening. Let's go. Open for business. Oh wait, there's perks like skills? Cutting master. Oh, we gotta pay money for that. Gradually increase the limit of your plates in the plate cabinet. Food now gradually burns more slowly. 2,000. That'd probably be a good one. Mm. Oh, she, she loves that. Mmm. Oh, they're loving it. All right, cool. I think I'll get another chicken ready while we wait. That chicken recipe back up here. Oh, you can only carry one plate at a time. Mm. <laughs> what in the food is this? Bro, this is a legit restaurant simulator. Typically, we only get these that are like a top-down, like kind of a strategic tycoon RTS type game. You know, like that, like top-down, um, maybe like The Sims or something like that. And of course, we got uh, Dave the Diver, but th this is a surprise, like, big dub. This is really good. Like, I can see the potential here for, like, going down all the other recipes and stuff. Like, right now it's starting a little slow and simple, but eventually we're going to be making, like, chicken legs and, uh, like, cupcakes. There, there's baking in this game, so it goes, oh, oh, pep pepperoni grill. Oh, can we make pizza? I don't know, but there's potential here for a lot of fun. And it's multiplayer. Although I'm only, Jesus, I'm only playing single right now. But I'm going to have to tell Dirty... I get into this. Because Dirty loves uh, barbecuing and stuff. You can play this up to four player, but I could definitely see this being uh, a little boring at the start for four people. Because there'd be not enough to do, but you get through that fast enough and then there's a lot to do. Cooking, cleaning, buying the ingredients, planning the menu, tending to the customers. Hmm. Oh, we're at. Oh, we need another one of these. Not 
bed. Oh, cold and overcooked. <laughs> what? Overcooked? I was standing there watching it. All right, you know what? I'm going to buy that perk. The fire wizard. Food now gradually burns more slowly. Oh, there's different tiers? Whatever. At least I bought the first tier. Oh, hi. Company policy. Everything's going in the fridge now. Oh. Wait, I'm already hearing... Hmm. Is the day already over? Wow, time goes by so quickly. Huh. Wait, never mind. I'm going to put this back in the fridge. Mm. It's fine. We're already, like, at the end of the day. How are you supposed to know if it's overcooked? Uh, well, there's like a, a meter that becomes darker, but... I, I guess if you, like... It's like it has to cook exactly like 57 seconds. And if you do 57.1, dude, overcooked. Like, these, uh, as if these people can tell. Dude, is this point one second overcooked? How dare you. Oh, bro, we're fresh out of chicken. How about some grilled beef? Sir. Bro, I'm not cooking up a chicken just for you. Beat it. You want the beef or you... No soup for you. You know what? We're close. Beat it. We have the beef, sir. Dude, dude you're just walking around on the... Dude, your royal highness... Walking around muddying up my floor. Get it, beat it, pal. Did I not kick his ass out? I wonder if this will disappear if I gotta throw it out. Oh, I gotta hit X. Okay. Okay. All right. Uh, I wonder if uh, stuff stays good forever so long as it's in the fridge. Oh, well. We'll learn by doing. This is awesome. Maybe, maybe we'll get Indrid and Morgan to play this with us. Uh, what? What does that mean? Oh, we made eight dishes. We gotta start cooking stuff that's more profitable, though. And we gotta start decorating more. the light does that actually matter if we turn the lights on and off is there a power bill can i break down my bill we can take out a loan oh there's bills uh there's nothing there okay let's do how do we paint again what color should we do maybe an off white color that could be nice. I don't know how I feel about that woodwork. What else you got? Maybe that one? That's oh, the same thing, just darker. Uh, oh wait. No, that's the same. That's white. 
Oh, we get a level up to. Oh, as we level up, we get more options. That's cool. Eh, we're kind of broke at the moment, though. Kind of. I want better income. Can we make beer? Mm, you know, I don't even see anything about serving drinks to customers. All right, let's get started. We'll do the chicken breast again. Wait, nine out of ten plates. Someone steal a plate? Okay, so at the end of the day, the food, the bad food, will just disappear. But you still gotta wash the dish. Okay. how we can prep stuff. I really like that. Alright. I wonder why they gave us two knives. Okay, green pepper. This actually kind of reminds me of that food truck simulator we played as well, which was actually quite nice. Who the hell is Sal Manila, Chad? I don't know who you're talking about. Is that it? Man, there's going to be so many dishes we can cook. This is going to be awesome. Okay, let's open. And I'll cook beef while we wait. We're gonna need to buy some more tomatoes. Hell, somebody just dropped a bunch of bottles on the floor. Mm. 
Uh, 22, thank you very much for the 222. Appreciate that, bro. Thank you very much. Got the tomatoes. Okay, we're definitely going to need to do a little bit more prep the next morning before. Not bad, though. We're getting better. Otherwise, we'll lose out mm. on customers. I'll be back. Parsley. Is it possible to hire another chef? Oh, that's true. We could do that. I could hire somebody. Five parsley times two. Five, four, six tomatoes. Gonna cut into our profits, though. Steven Seagal. I know. We use the same sponge to clean the floor as we do the plates. Good stuff. What's up, Russell? Welcome, dude. Hmm. Man, I even spent good money on the don't burn stuff upgrade, and it still burns. You gotta be, like, right there. steak. Oh. We need more chickling. Dude, it's already the end of the day. Man, the days go by so fast. Mm. Holy hell. Sorry about the chicken breast, man. We don't have any, but wow. Hi, ma'am. How you doing? Yeah, thanks for the money back. In your face. Ten out of ten on cleanliness, I know. I can't believe the game doesn't have like a, a mop or a broom or something. Oh well, sorry, sir. Do you want a to go plate? Or man oh wait, where'd that are you the same person who was oh yeah, oh, wait. I think I don't know. Okay, some people like the grilled beef. Ah, shame. Such wasted food. Oh, I don't even have to clean that? Okay. All right, tomorrow we're going to uh, do things a little differently. Also, how do I unlock more stuff? Recipes. Oh, that's different than menu. Well, we could make tomato soup. Hmm. 
chicken legs. Oh, we get. Do we have to? Is there a requirement before we get there? Some of these are locked. Mastery one. Maybe we got to keep on the tier one stuff until we get to a certain level. Probably what it is. Well, that's what it is. There's our enemies. Oh, that's cool. Oh, they don't even have the final boss battle in yet. Warehouse menu. Okay, so as we're making more of these things, we're leveling up. So now the chicken breast and the beef is going to be even better because we've made it so many times, I guess. Oh, there we go. Daily expenses. Wow, we're even more profitable now. Customer reactions, eight. What does that mean? Oh, there we go. Now we unlock some recipes. Okay. All right, so to unlock recipes, we just got to do other recipes. Okay. James, thank you very much for the uh, the five. Appreciate it, dude. All right, well, let's do tomato soup then. And chicken legs. And what do we have to do for that? The tomato soup is, oh boy. We're gonna have to buy a pot, I think. Water, milk, butter, parsley. And tomato, of course. Screech, thank you very much for the five, dude. Since you started playing Pacific Drive, my butt-clenching moments have gone up 4,000%. Cardiologist said that you have to stop playing it. I did. They took away my my demo for that game. It was like a closed creator-only demo. But, you know, we'll play it again soon. What the hell is that? A skull? All right, we got, like, sausages and rack of ribs. Oh, is that liver? Oh... I'll need to buy chicken legs. I'll come back here in a minute. Let's let's do with the tomato recipe first. Woo! Woo! All right, let's do. Um, I think we'll go here first. And Screech, thank you very much for the gift bomb for chat. Thank you very much. All right, so we can't buy tomato paste. Got to be a fresh tomato. But I do need to buy a cook pot for the tomato soup. Transfer to bowl. Oil. Okay, so we'll need a cook pot and then we'll need a... Uh, is there not a hot plate here? I think we need to buy one at the... Okay, we'll need to buy one. In the construction menu. Okay. So then stations, there it is, single stove. Oh, and then we could buy multiple grills too. Okay, so if you're playing multiplayer, there, there's probably a way where you could just delete the starting kitchen and all that stuff and then just redesign everything. You can put in multiple stoves, although, I don't know, man. I don't know if you need that much stuff. You, it seems like you got to prepare everything by the beginning of the day. There's not much, like... Once you open, it's kind of like set in stone. Anyway. Okay, so let's get that thing going. 
we need the need this thing going. Put it at the end. Yeah, I bought this thing new and it. Ooh. The gas one. Nice. Okay, cool. Alright, and then. Let's work on the chicken leg stuff. Chicken leg, salt, chili pepper, tomato, tomato, potato. Okay, we're gonna need to buy a hell of a lot of tomatoes. What do we got for potatoes? Eight. Did I buy tomatoes? Five. Mmm. And also, once we cook something and put it under this plate, the time's ticking because it will cool down. So we can't, like, make everything. But I think we'll make the new stuff. Let's make the tomato soup, and then what was the chicken legs again? Salt, chili pepper, tomato, and potato. That's it. Tomato, potato. How's it going, pal? I'll take the uh, chicken leg for 90. I'm trying to think how many servings this will make. Does it say? Hmm. We need two each. Alright, I'll just... I'll just do that. And then what can we get for employees? Washing dishes, washing dishes. Oh, nobody can cook. It's all you. So cleaning, washing dishes, and... Oh, they can be a waiter. So they basically just bring the plate back, I assume. What do you mean a waiter? Like, the people come in and get their own stuff, then they basically flag you down. I, I guess the waiter would just tell them they're free to leave. You're, you're free to go, sir, after they collect the money and then bring the plate back and wash it. That's $250 weekly. Bro, we could do that. Let's hire, uh... Whoa, 1000 weekly? What the hell? Oh, she's a level 20. Oh. Um, I'll hire Natalie. And I can't. It, it's locked. Okay, great. <sighs> We're going to need to buy another fridge for... One for... Just for meat. I, I have to close the doors. <laughs> it just doesn't feel right to leave the door wide open. Okay, wait a minute. Let's start with tomato soup then. We'll do that. Oh, damn it. I need to go buy butter and milk and parsley. We have parsley. Okay, so we want butter and milk.
So it's uh, 200 grams. And milk is 0.2 liters. Well, how much is in a can of <laughs> How much is in a can of butter? Where's milk? Bro, it's not even refrigerated. Don't we need a uh, the, the tomatoes here are for tomato paste, so that might be a pasta or something. Screech with a five gifted memberships for chat. Thank you very much, dude, for the support. Oh, if, if I walk out the door, yeah, without paying for this stuff, it'll probably just disappear. It's more like I'm telling the guy what I want than he d It's like old school general stores or something. Okay, milk and butter. I like how these weren't refrigerated. Oh boy. All right, let's make this soup. Oh yeah, we got it. All right, so. Add two point, no, one point two. How much is in there? Damn it. No, dump it out. There. Whatever. I added point five too much. Whatever. Whatever. All right. Um, tomato slices times eight. Hold on. Okay. If we're going to be cooking and stuff like this, we need some cooking music. Uh, let's see. DMCA free cooking music. Let's see what comes up. Cooking music royalty free.
Wait, this says it needs a grill. Isn't that... Okay, that's what we already got. Okay. He needs to chill with the burning. I don't like it. It's, it's too positive. I can't allow that. Man, listen to this guy. Mm. It's music to specifically make people want kebabs. Yes, it's true. Oh, whoa, whoa. Mmm. Also, we have tables that seat two, but yet only one person always comes in. I do like the fact, though, that we're unlocking more recipes by just simply making recipes. Oh, oh no, we're good. Huh. And mm. I like how our recipes are just getting better by us doing them, I think. Both as, like, a person, like, I'm getting better because now I know what I'm doing, but also the game's like, oh yeah, you know what you're doing. Hmm. Man, people are excited to eat this food. 
Rachel Ray, you ain't got nothing on me, girl. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Uh-oh, she's here. She heard I was huh. talking smack. What's that? Two bowl. Okay, let's do chicken leg again. Mm. Salt. Chili pepper. Tomato. Oh, wrong one. Eh, whatever. Sanitation doesn't matter. People don't care. They don't care about sanitation. These people care about uh, what was it slightly burned by 0.1 second. Oh, it was? Disgusting. Oh, that soup is good. Respect. I'm not sure why I doubled down on that. Because I think we're going to run out of time. Presentation doesn't matter, just ship it. Yep. Mm. Now what's interesting is the time of day has frozen. Why? The day is stuck at 1740. She wants soup. Okay. Yeah, bye, bye. Okay. serving it cold well if I would have left the burnt like in real life mm. you leave that burner on stir it a little bit Ooh, 
Whew, okay, not bad. Mm. Oh, I didn't realize you were still here, man. Whoa. Look at all this trash. Come on, people. That's the messy seat. Well, come on, man. Keep you keep trashing the place. <laughs> they literally bring in trash bags and then dump them on the ground. I didn't make that trash bag. They did. Well, let's dump this out, I guess. Oh, do, I, do I need to wash this? Okay, man, I really want to buy like another refrigerator. I think we should do that. I don't even know what we'd use the shelf for. Most, It might just be a better idea organization-wise to throw everything into the refrigerator. Even if it doesn't need to be refrigerated, which I think everything probably does, but like the fact that you just have to go to the fridge for everything is just in your mind, just one, one stop. So where's our refrigerators? 2,000. That's worth it. Cha-ching. Yeah, the milk and the butter apparently doesn't need to be refrigerated, but with everything being in one spot, it might be... Uh, Better idea. I mean, eventually when we start buying, like, flour and yeast, we could probably put it on this shelf. But at a certain point, it's like, I don't know. Like, we, if we were playing with friends, we, you may as well, like, put the bakery in here or something. Like, just have somebody working in the, in the back room. The back rooms. Dude, he said it. Okay, let's do chick. Okay, we're going to do... Meat in the left one and vegetable in the right. Non non meats. That tomato. Chicken. Ribeye chicken breast. Can we rotate to the side? Ah, oh, then you can't see what's there. That'd be a much more effective way to store things. And then there should be I guess we're out of the other stuff. I'll store it overflow. I just want to be able to see everything. Okay, cool. Get out of here. Let's get at them. Oh, can we uh, spend perks? Cutting master, increase your cutting speed. Increase the limit of your plates. Reduce the proportion of dirty plates from customers. Reusing a plate? Yikes. Apply discounts to all purchasable materials and items. Okay. Guess we don't have to close. Like at a certain point, people just stop coming anyway. This game's cool, man. 
Can you combine pro uh, boxes of produce? I'm not sure. Like, you'd think though that if we took a tomato and like tried to put it into a box with tomatoes in it, that it would just add to that, but I guess not. Yeah, I did go buy a bunch of stuff. What is Automat earnings? Can we buy a laundromat or something? There's something that we can buy that will make money on the side. Let's go look around town a little bit. Oh my god, that's terrifying. What is that? Why are they doing that? Ooh, we can also have an outdoor cafe. Oh, that that's what this is. When you get to this tier, when you can go here, this is the fancy little cafe with the outside seating and stuff. This, this bar? Champagne, Pilsner, red wine, whiskey, beer, and cocktails. This has just got to be for hanging out with friends at the end of the day. Oh, is there a minigame? Oh, there is! Oh, yeah, this is for friends. Like when you're playing mall. game we plan <laughs> what is it every one of these games has to have gambling and it always has to be blackjack and I always win the first time every time they get you in and then they screw you unless it's lens island oh I got screwed so bad by Black Bart or whatever his name was. Lucky Jim or whatever the hell. Scam artist name. And I'm out. I'm, I'm cashing out, boys. Big day for me. I just double closed the place. Give me the deed to the bar. I just won big. I'm out. <laughs> I'm out of here. Oh, man. Someone clip and ship that. Someone make that a clip for me, please. I need that. Wow. Bro, you can just come here and just gamble it all away. Is that a Seinfeld reference? Isn't isn't this a reference to Seinfeld? The proctologist uh, thing? I'm pretty sure. Sublime. Wait, Maine is known as the vacation land? Oh my god, Olive Garden. Hello, beer. Goodbye, problems. Wow. Oh, kitties. This is a great pub. Bro, it is 8.29 in the morning. I didn't even have to do anything with Blackjack, by the way. I sat down and hit, like, bet $10, and then she just started dealing, and it hit 21, and it's like... It, it, couldn't, be, it couldn't have been more perfect, by the way. It, I, I didn't have to hit nothing. It was just immediate win. Just free money simulator. You may as well have been like, oh, he's here. All right. That, that's all she had to do. All right. By the way, this is a, a restaurant simulator, by the way, chat. <laughs> I kind of forgot that for a minute. 
I don't want to totally go gambling again. By the way, special request to all devs who make these games. Yes, there's always a casino or some sort of gambling that's required. But also, could you guys put in a coin pusher? I'd appreciate that, thanks. Coin pusher, please. All right. Um, what are we going to make? Wait, is there is there like a pricing? Like, what's making us the most money here? 180. Hundred and fifty six. Hundred and ten. The soup seemed to have served a lot of people though. Oh, grilled beef was one forty. What's the most? Oh, the chicken legs are at one eighty. Alright, I'll make some chicken legs. And then what else are we gonna make? We gotta do a beef or vegetarian option. Oh, there's the price, 140. Oh, that's going up. Actually, if we make grilled beef again, that might hit level 3 and that might charge more. What does the star mean? Is that what it currently is or like can we increase that? Oh, that gives us fame. Oh. I think check and see if there's a oh there's brick oh the brick oven cool dude we need to be able to do pizza then game needs pizza I left the door open yeah that doesn't seem to matter even with the fridge as long as it's in the fridge okay um Oh yeah, so one more thing to the menu. Let's just do tomato soup. And we'll start with the soup. One point one eight liters. Okay, let me pin that recipe. Okay, so we need two sliced tomatoes. Butter and milk. Apparently we just put in a whole thing of milk and a whole thing of butter. And then we boil that and then add parsley at the end. Fancy. Uh oh. Nice. They're serious. Like, how quickly can you? Oh, did I throw that plate in the trash? <laughs> Don't do that. Yeah, they're serious at how quickly you bring that thing over. Damn it. 
I gotta go buy chicken legs again. Chicken leg one, chicken leg two. Change that recipe. Two chicken leg, there we go. Nope. Leg. There we go. Okay, so it's gotta be salt and chili pepper. Big old plate. Okay. Those things burn so quickly, man. Okay, go, 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 go. No time at all. Play again, the blackjack. Now, now, chat. We're not going to get lucky seven times in a row. We're going to have 10 to 13 customers now. This place is getting popular as hell. More popular than Raptor memberships on YouTube. Or Twitch Prime subs. Oh my god. Alright, let's go. Should probably also purchase more cooking stations. The soup is right here. There you go. Dude, she was that lady licked mm. the plate. Mm. My man. Down the station for more soup. Mm. Oh, you can only do one? soup in there too. Ah, oh, that's what that noise means. Hmm. Not hot, but it'll... Dude, don't we have heat lamps? Can't we do what McDonald's does? I don't know, look at me go. I'm freaking... 
turbo, man. Chicken's right there, sir. Yep. Hmm. Gotta go fast. Faster, faster. Hey, Raptor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, sir. Thank you very much for coming on in today, sir. Have a great day. You are outstanding. Just like a scarecrow. Outstanding in a field. Pro strat. At least that person actually bagged up their trash before they threw it on the ground. Hmm. Restaurant level up. Let's go. Oh, we're out of soup again. Okay, tomato soup is hot. They love it. Oh, I'm out of parsley, though. Uh, no, we're not. We're good. Hope you all love cold soup. Right here, sir. There you go. Mm. Ooh. Yeah, soup is uh, very popular. This is a soup town. You playing the game I recommended? Yeah, I wanted to play this one. I, I didn't, actually didn't know it came out today. I was on that whole... Uh, you know, I've been on the whole, like, hey, let's play these wacky business simulator games, and this is one of them, and I like it. I want to play more Beer Factory, too, but I kind of wish that was multiplayer as well. This is... And this I'm going to have to play again. I'm going to have to tell Alex and everybody else to get this one. Hmm. I know everybody's wanted us to play Payday 3 again, but I don't know, man. Something cool about playing this multiplayer. This game's going to be even better the next time, because I'll kind of know what to do, and I'll try to... I'll boss everyone around. The boss. I'm the boss. Wow, that fire went all day, dude. That used to burn out. There it goes. Okay, looks good. All right, let's run over the store, uh, the shop, the market. we have to pay a bill for electricity and for like when, when we go into bills I don't actually see I guess this bills here is just related to the in uh, the um uh, the interest on the on the loan but I don't know if like you know if, if we actually have to pay money for um like electricity or natural gas for the 
Uh, the stove or anything? than this. Unfortunately, it doesn't give us like a green outline as to where those are going to be placed. I could put them up here, maybe. Yeah, maybe that'd be better. We can put bowls and stuff down there. Mm. Much more organized chat. Good. Love it. An update. Nope, just refresh in all caps. That's all you got to do. their music I, I the radio is supposed to be in our storage the hell we're doing a giveaway in our di in our discord right now discord giveaway pog There's a giraffe in that box. Uh, maybe, maybe it's an empty. Aren't empty boxes supposed to disappear?
happened to our, uh... What happened to our milk and butter? We should have had some at the beginning of day five. Actually, we gotta go here. Hey, what's up, Shrike? Parsley, I'm pulling tomatoes. What the hell? Like it rotted. All right, let's go buy some chicken legs. Wait, it looks like it merged some of these boxes together. That's we really weird. There's combinations of stuff in order that I didn't buy it. That's kind of weird. Okay, anything from here? Now we just need the chicken legs. now. Gotta cut that up. Standing 
Chef dog. Oh, I, yeah, I wonder if we can make fries, chat, like in the... In like a deep fryer. That'd be cool. Chowder with the two, this is no bribe. Well, you want more soupy chowder? I don't know where the hell that music's coming from because I don't have a radio. There. Army marching in. Oh man, people love that tomato soup, dude. Mm. Right there, sir. You just gotta, gotta pick that up. Right there. All right, good luck. Chicken right there. Oh, there's tr is there trash in the way? Plate socket empty. The hell does that mean? The fuck, bro. He gets he gets mad and then leaves because he can't figure out where the damn soup is. is this dumb AI alert stop it stop being dumb hello you guys are ruining my gaming experience there how about that just randomly in the middle of the floor Oh my god. Wait, that's what that means? Wait, what the... Wait, what the hell? We... Wait, what? Wait, that doesn't make any sense. We have one free pl Wait, what the hell? Where do we get more plates? Where, where did all my plates go? Hmm. Wait, where, where did they go? Where do you buy new plates? doesn't make any sense. Wait, I even bought an upgrade that's supposed to give me more plates. How the hell did we lose 12 plates? I mean, I... Someone finishes their <laughs> meal, I, I take their dirty plate, I put it in the... in the washing machine and then I put it right there. What? Ooh. 
The store has it? Okay. Oh, what, is somebody stealing the plates, though? Like, why are we... I mean, if I if I have 12 plates and I make 12 meals and then I do dishes 12 times, then we should have 12 in there. Where are they going? Ma'am... It's not like they're going anywhere else. Mm. I got a perk that even gives us more. No, the, the plates in the game are all just like... Think of them like uh, currency. Like if you put any sort of bowl or plate in here and then you put it in here. It, if a, a bowl, if it needs to, will convert to a plate so that someone can eat a meal. Mm. Yeah, there's got to be a plate thief. <laughs> like this is so weird. Like I don't... Wow. Water the soup again. Love that soup, dude. Oh, weird. Wait, did that guy just steal a bowl? That guy didn't leave a bowl behind. What is that supposed to symbolize? Like, s plates being broken? Kind of a weird side mechanic. We have like a perk where every once in a while we don't have to clean a plate, which is weird. Alright, I'm gonna buy a bunch of plates. Apparently somebody was stealing our plates and putting them on the plate black market, which is why I was completely confused. Yeah, no soup for you. That was so weird. I mean, someone was coming in here and stealing our plates. Like, what the hell? I mean, plates certainly get broken, but I mean, if that's a game mechanic, then make a noise. It happens. It's not a big deal.
Okay. Well, we'll have to know about that for next time. That was a very strange. Also, plate socket empty doesn't really make me doesn't really make me think like, oh, the plates are out. Okay. It should just say plate out of plates, not plate socket empty. Oh. Yeah, it's realistic to have to buy the plates, yeah. They don't really Like what is somebody coming in and like putting it in their purse? Be like, oh man, I gotta get into Raptor's restaurant, dude. He's got the best china. I gotta, I gotta save money by stealing all his silverware and stuff so we can put the kids through college. Ah. <sighs> That was a bad day. I have confusion. Do we lock the door? No, this, this is a town of no crime. Except for a frickin' plate thief. Oh, we can put three things on the menu now. Okay. Oh, so now we can buy multiple. We haven't even named our restaurant yet. Um... Place dish raspberry pie. Wait, what? I right, definitely tomato. Chicken. I guess we'll do a beef option. Uh, chicken breast for one fifty six three. Now we're gonna do chicken legs. The so soup, chicken legs, and oh, we'll do a beef option. Actually, I don't know if we have enough money to do all this stuff. Um. Oh, we got a lot of ribeye. And tomato. Alright, let's start with that. Let's get everything together so it goes quickly. So we're doing the ribeye first. Oh, that's right. I got to go buy charcoal and stuff again. What the hell are you lining up for? We're not even open. Man, they're waiting. Those people need that tomato soup, dude. It's, I got to get my fix. I need it. Uh, yeah, charcoal. No. Woo! Woo! Dude, people are lining up now. Lining up. Five, six. Actually, we can leave one out. Yep, I very much want to play with this with friends.
very much. Okay, let's salt. Pepper. Oh my god, that was the wrong one. No, it's not. Cut, cut, go, go. Okay, get ready to flip. Beautiful. Other tomato. Raptor's Dino? I think we're just going to call this the Dino Diner. Finally, after eight years of work, we've finally completed the Dino Diner. That dramatic saga has come to an end. Back from when Shrike was a nine-year-old. Don't need a tomato, I want that. Why is that pulling tomatoes? What the hell? That was parsley! What in the black magic is going on? Whatever, this one's ready to go, so I'm just going to put it under there. Alright, I'll finish that up later. Oh wait, there's parsley. That one's ready to go on standby. Alright, soup time. We need two tomatoes. Alright, I really appreciate the uh, refrigerator being made of glass, too, because we can actually see what's in there. It can be so helpful in multiplayer. Okay, time for soup. 1.20. little short. 1.12. Oh my god. Fine. Be a little watered down, but whatever, they can call the cops. Okay, we're good. Then, finally, the chicken legs. I kind of find it weird how, like, we're not making things to order, we just kind of make it beforehand, which is kind of weird when you have a group of friends because. If the gameplay were a little slower during the day, everyone could kind of wait on orders and then make the order when the customer's here. Oh no. All this stuff went bad.
might be able to do a tomato though. <sighs> Can you lower the heat? No. It's open flame, so we can't really can't really do too much. Oh, it reminds you of the paleo cooking? Yeah, it was fun to do with Uthras too. It was really fun to to play with you guys in that one. Paleo is cool. Then we got to go buy some potato, potato. We'll have to do a whole store run at the end of the day. I wonder if that's a glitch, people standing out like that. I, it seems weird that they actually want to come to this restaurant. So the uh, refrigerator seems to buy us a couple of days. A couple of days. Makes a difference. Makes a difference, but it's just a couple of days. up while we wait for that. Is that keto? Yeah, we're doing we're doing keto. Mm. These people, they want soup on standby. I need to go buy parsley, damn it. Mmm. Mmm. How the hell are we down to three plates? Dude, prepaid. All right. Huh. Uh, soup's out. Nope. I gotta go buy the. I need parsley. There we go. <laughs> no one's buying the beef. There, I know how you all feel about your soup, even if it's cold. Crazy people. Mmm. Mmm. Crackling in the fire is nice, though, while we're cooking, right? Level six. Mm. Huh. I wonder, this is missing parsley, but let's see what happens if we deliver it with missing an ingredient. Okay, ooh, it only, oh, okay. Only took off like a couple of percent. Mm. Oh, no, 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 no. Mm. What? 
that's missing the okay. Oh. They don't care. They just want these tomato addicts. Tomaco. That's what they want. Yeah, apparently the AI can clean and do the dishes and uh, collect the money and stuff for you. Okay, so people are just stealing our plates, right? Also, it'd be nice to just tell a customer that we don't have something and I'm not willing to make it. Like, <laughs> like man, we're too, we're too far into EOD. So that's a no-can do. Also, uh, there's a self-checkout. You... Make the order. You come on in and place the order. Make the order yourself. Just pay me for nothing. I'm all powerful. All right, well, if you don't want soup, then whatever. Can't help you. So people are legit stealing our plates. Like what, why do we have to do such a huge expense to uh, I think I gave you shack vibes, yeah. Why do we have to do such a huge loss to business for plates? Like we should have 12. We're only gonna regain two more, so what, we're up to seven? And what happened to all the rest of the plates? Dude, we need to hire security. Like heavy security. Risking people down. I want a plate sniffing dog. And how many plates are we breaking a day? And that's weird. The, the plate mechanic is weird. Like it totally makes sense that people should or you like plates should go broken. Like they should break. That makes sense. But like for them to go MIA, like, is this how people are funding their their lives? Is selling them on the black market? Onion volcanoes and Grillville. Oh yeah, <laughs> the onion volcano from what Benihana? Yeah, that's the way to go. If we, uh, whoa, we almost made two thousand bucks. Oh, oh, there we go. Now we actually get some... What What are these reactions, though? I don't know what this means. Amazing, outstanding, incredible, bad, bad, bad. I don't know what that means. Just having a bunch of random-ass numbers with, with no way to read them doesn't really tell me what the... Oh, I guess maybe that was... Um... Okay, I think that's reactions per day. So that's a graph of the whole, like, week. Okay, I see. If you don't get the plate back when the self-serve dish goes empty. I don't know. It's like we're paying a daily plate tax. And it's weird. But this game is damn good, dude. Alright, things start out a little slow. But I can see a hell of a lot of potential here, too. Like, in terms of decorating the walls and the floor. And putting down potted plants and whatnot. But more importantly, it seems like it's going to be a lot more fun. Like, this is going to be a real fun time when we get to baking and stuff like that. And when we get to play with friends. Because if we can play up to four four people, uh, I, I'd love to throw Dirty behind the uh, counter here and have, have him whipping up all the dishes. And then I'll just keep track of the menu and get him the ingredients he needs. And then if we play with, like, Lumberjack 2, uh, we can take turns doing that, me and Lumberjack. And then we can have somebody else collecting uh, all the money and bringing it in for the business and then collecting all the plates and bringing it over here to the WAS station. Now, another thing to consider, too, is per player... 
If the perks are tied. Okay, apparently I have all three. Okay, this is. I Okay, I think I broke the game. Now it shows that I have all three perks, but I don't. I didn't buy these, though. I don't. I don't know. This is a good game, but there's some uh, cu couple couple holes in the in the plot line here. But I mean, that's pretty cool. I, I love this uh, multiplayer games where we can play together to build a business or something like that is really cool. Open TTD, Planet Coaster, this game, all very cool. We'll have to see. Uh, the only awkward part about the game, in general, though, is you pl like you basically make everything at the start. Then you open the restaurant and then close, and there's not really anything like... I was expecting a customer comes in, sits down, they place an order, then you got to make that order and then give it to them. But in this case, it's kind of more of a buffet. Like, you come in, you grab whatever you want off the buffet, and then sit down. But when we make a singular dish, it makes a random number of dishes. Or at least, I'm not sure how many servings are per dish... But whatever. <laughs> it's pretty cool. Anybody want a coffee? Yeah, drinks would be cool too. There's a there's potential here for like pizza, a deli, uh, like a barista, like having a coffee bar or like, well, I mean, they have a, they literally have a bar down the road. So I wouldn't be surprised if they had a bar update where you could actually go and own the bar instead. Like it would be really cool if not only can we own a small little kebab shop, but also a, like kind of a nicer, fancier cafe for desserts and stuff, but then just ending up buying the bar. Which, I don't know, this may be a reference to another game made by this developer. I have no idea. Oh, those cars are cool, though. Ooh, look at those cars. Nice. Garbage, nice. One more bet. I bet you won't subscribe to the channel and smash like. I bet I'll win that bet. All right, fine. We'll we'll do one more day of gambling. What a weird. Okay. It's kind of weird. Like when you sit down, you just look at the ground. Like I can't freely look around when I'm. Like if I want to look at the dealer, I have to like sit like this. There we go. I'll do ten dollars. I'll do ten. I'll do ten. Uh, son of a bitch. I should have never listened to chat. All right, one more. She's gonna get twenty-one. Oh, she busts. Yeah, one more. One more. One more. We gotta come out on top. Hit me. God damn. Okay. We gotta, we gotta win two more now. We gotta win two more. That's uh, hit me. Okay. She's gonna get twenty-one. Oh, she busts again. By right, this time, we're going crazy. It's gonna be. I'm putting down a hundo. Okay, that's fine. We're gonna get twenty-seven. We're screwed. God. Nah, forget it. I'm out. Trying to see if I can find some sort of a scam device. I'm just looking around, making sure nothing's shenanigan -y. Whatever. All right, guys, that's going to be all our time for today for the kebab restaurant. This is damn solid. I like this. I mean, there's a the concept and, and the execution's good. There's a few things that are going to have to buff out. Uh, just came out today, so hopefully by the end of next week, they've got a lot of this solved. The plate things are weird. I went over a couple of those things, but... Anyway, we got to play this next time in multiplayer. I think we'll start fresh with the boys so they can experience everything from day one. 
All right, I'm going to be back with maybe more uh, Pal World because that was a lot of fun. I don't know if uh, Dirty or anybody else wants to play, but maybe maybe I'll do that. Maybe not. I think maybe, but I don't know. We'll see. Anyway, I'll be back in just a little bit. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you all soon. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Goodbye.